Hi, Danielle here from Arnold Tutoring. Today we're going to complete the square when there's a leading coefficient in front of the x squared. Um, and this is to get an equation into vertex form. So we're going to start by factoring out this leading coefficient, so the negative 2, out of the first two terms. So I'm left with x squared minus 8x, and then a close bracket plus 1. We always have to factor this entire value out, no matter what it is. It has to come out of the first two terms. So now I'm going to follow my normal completing the square steps. And I have x squared minus 8x, and the number that we're going to add is divide this number by 2, so that gives us negative 4, and then we square it. So we're going to add 16. I'm going to do my big brackets here. And then we have to take away 16, because whatever we add, we have to uh, add the opposite. So negative 16 plus 1. So now I'm going to make my perfect square. So that's x minus 4, all squared, minus 16. We're still in the brackets, plus 1. In order to get rid of these square brackets, I have to multiply back out negative 2 times negative 16, so that's going to be plus 32, then plus 1 at the end. Again, because I'm moving the negative 16 out of the bracket, I have to multiply it by that leading coefficient. So my final step is y equals negative 2 x minus 4 squared, and then I just combine these constants at the end. 32 plus 1 is 33. So my vertex is 4, 33. Hopefully that helps see how we can complete the square with the leading coefficient.